Good morning everybody, Shirtless Jake here guys. Today I'm going to be hopping up on my dad's tractor here, using the bucket and heading over to the backyard where we'll be doing some cleanup and some work out there. I don't think I'll be mowing out there with the brush hog today, but we are going to use the bucket and do a lot of work with the rocks and everything else around there. But little Willow is over here just a neighing. Good morning, sweet girl. Why'd you come over there? Look, hey, we can see each other right here. We can see each other right here if you want to poke your head through this way. You know what? Come, come around. Come around. I'll get you a snack real quick before I go work. Come on. Come on, Willow. Come on. Go around. Come on. Go around. Go around, sweet girl. Can you do it? Uh, yeah, she'll uh, she'll figure it out. Let's, let's get her a snack. Good morning, sweet girl. I've only brought two, okay? Usually my limit's five. But I've only brought two. And what I'll do is I'll give you two now. And maybe uh, three or 30 later today. How about that? I'll give you about three or 30 later today. Here you go. Good? Good? Everything good? Okay, great. Great. Good girl. Good girl. You're a sweet baby. You're a sweet baby. I got a surprise for you later. I really do. But for right now, I gotta get my lazy butt to work. Oreo, stop trying to wrestle. Everybody's just doing their own thing. Stop trying to wrestle with her. Seriously, that's probably exactly why Moses won't leave the fence and he's standing there all mad. Cause Oreo's over here. Oreo, you don't even know what you're doing. All right, guys, so the first thing that we got to do this morning is go around this entire backyard and everywhere where we see piles of concrete or more piles of concrete or all the stepping stones, wherever those are, all the stepping stones, more concrete. There's a bunch of concrete over here at the chicken coop area. Anywhere where there's rocks and concrete and big stuff, we got to get picked up. We got to get it put in the, in the tractor bucket where Glenn is currently scratching his... Glenn... That's not what that's for. You know, Glenn, that is not what that's for, partner. Please excuse me. I'm, I'm going to get to work, y'all. I got all the rocks, all the concrete, whatever, loaded up in the tractor bucket here. And then I just took all the stones the stepping stones they're still really good stepping stones i just took them all and set them over there so i'll go dump this rock in a i guess at the gully somewhere and then uh i'll ask everybody if they need those stones and if not i'll just stack them up neatly in the back somewhere so if they do need them they can always come get them themselves uh sweet girl it's not time to mow yet i know you're trying it's just not time all right, guys, everything is out of here. Now what we got to do is come down. We got to try to, like, take the bucket and uh, level out this rock here, the rock in the middle, and the rock that was on that side. And then we'll see what we're looking at along this back edge. But it looks pretty good. It doesn't look like we're going to have to do too much. Maybe maybe cut it to grade a little bit, which means match the, uh, the ground, like, make it all level. But, guys, this shouldn't be too hard i don't mind if i take up a little bit of grass along this process but we've got to make sure we can try to get these rocks out somehow some way i don't we'll just see what happens is one scoop along this little rock pile here guys so now what we'll do is we'll match the bucket to this grade right here you see the level you see how we got this part level right here and then it kind of steps up a little bit so what we'll do is we'll match the bucket to this line right here and uh we'll just continue going down the rock road and that'll scoop out every bit of rock and make this ground completely level we might have to go get us a little bit of sand to scoop a sand or two come put in a little bit of fill dirt and that sand will help this grass grow as well so it's just a process y'all but we're getting it
All right, guys, all the tractor work is done. I got all this stuff smoothed out, all the rocks picked up, all this stuff smoothed out, all the rocks picked up. Now, I did get a little bit gougy in this area, but that's, that's not a big deal, guys. I was going to mow before I did that, but I figured it'd be better to get all, all the rocks and then mow and kind of knock down some stuff, too. But this side's done, too. Now, guys, for real, we're going to go get some gas at the gas station. We're going to fill up our little push mower over there. Going to kind of knock down all this stuff the best we can. And then I believe this afternoon my dad's going to come out here and, and mow everything. So we got to make sure that every little thing is picked up. That's why I'm going to sacrifice the push mower first. Because I'm not going not to let him ruin his good mower out here. I've taken the little grass catcher off the back of the mower. Because this is way too much grass, guys. If... Like, there's no way we're going to catch all of this grass. We'd have to empty this thing out, like, every strip or less. And it's just it's just not efficient that way. So I might have to deal with some rocks maybe flying out of here and hitting me in the legs and stomach and stuff. But I think, guys, if we can just muscle through it one time. If we can just muscle through it one time, guys, I think we'll be all right. I got the mower set on the highest setting. And I'm going to kind of pick it up in the air so it cuts even higher. Hopefully the cows have thinned it out quite a bit, which... I mean, I guess they have, but not not in the way that I was hoping they would. It's going to be a hard mow job, but if we can just get in here and thin it out real good, guys, and get it kind of all knocked down to where the big mower can get out here, I think we'll be all right. But I do want it to look pretty when we're done right here. Now there still is some cleanup guys just some random debris there's some sand we got to bring in there's some just random stuff that we just got to pick up and get organized again and and just get back to looking like like a normal backyard but let me show you because i am i'm impressed myself guys i'm i'm honestly impressed with with my own work this time here it goes the big reveal y'all this place this place is starting to look like a backyard we got short grass we got all the rocks mowed out we got mostly everything picked up guys all we got to do now is get some sand and kind of level this stuff out here kind of level this stuff out here especially in this one little dip down right here uh, maybe a little bit of sand over there guys, but that's that's no big deal We got everything mowed down to where we can see good now and uh, we'll just come out here tomorrow probably and Start leveling off this whole yard. We'll just level the entire yard. That's all for this one. Bye guys Have a great day